I may need to level my dudes up a little bit. But then again, maybe not. Nothing ventured, nothing gained, they say. Let's get moving. I think I can take the gym at this level. I think. And as for the fate of that Toxel that I was given, whose name I don't remember, you know what, what was his name? I need to figure this out. There, the boxes are, there we go. Uh, Blurglox, that is your name. One person said, yes, it's fine. Another person said, it's fine, as long as I hadn't caught another one in the area in which I had received him. And that area was... It was the one back there, wasn't it? The one with the Pokemon nursery, the way you breed them. Where's my map? There it is. Town map. It doesn't just say map, it's town map. And Route 5. Yeah, I think I already caught something there, didn't I? If that is the case... Yeah, I think I got Quarglump there. Where did I get you? It should say... Uh, right... Yeah, it was on Route 5. Yes, I already got one there, so I got Quarglump and Blurglox is... Illegal, if I'm going strictly by the one per area rule, which I am, so Blurglox is unusable due to the Nuzlocke rules. Very unfortunate. I will not show leniency on that rule. But before I go to the gym, did I just see a yep, I saw a shiny object, super portions. I need to find you. You are the gym leader, you need to be at the gym! Ah damn, she needs a voice too. I ain't good at lady voices. You must be a gym challenger, right? This is just my default voice for female characters. How did you know? You're one of the ones endorsed by Leon, right? You've become something of a hot topic among the gym leaders. Here you go, Ms. Famous. I already heard about you, so you should learn about me, too. Good. I will use this information to crush you in battle. That is, assuming that League card has any information. Let's head to the stadium. I love fishing, but I love Pokemon battles even more. And I'm itching for a battle with you. Alright. We will see just who comes out on top. It's probably going to be me. I never come out on the bottom. Only in rare cases does that happen. Jesus Christ, how do you do that with your leg? I can't do that. Highest I can get my leg is about this high. I can... Ow. Legs are not meant to do that. Her father is a fisher, her mother works in the marketplace, perhaps because of her parents... Yeah, no useful information. Just backstory. I don't need backstory. I need tactics. I need strategy. But the only strategy I need is to kill water with things that kill water. With things like Nurbluck and Quarglump. Torque and Brainless. They might be able to pull some weight here. They might be pulling some weight. Kronglub, you will not do any good here. You know what? What other Pokemon do I have to use? I got Rum Rum and Flurmblop. Blurglox, you're illegal, so we're just gonna hide you. Uh. Not sure I'll be putting you in the grave, since you technically didn't die. This box, it needs a name. Illegal. That's where I'll be putting the Pokemon that I have that I cannot use that didn't technically die. So, Blurglox, you go there. The grave only has Lung Butter, and I'll be moving you over here, because I noticed that my face cam kind of blocks you there. 
while when I was looking at this back in editing. But anyway, I don't really have anyone else to substitute Krongloob for. Ball guy! Hey there, thanks for that! Room I have a chat with your mate, the ball guy! I see you have a fishing rod in that case, I got a perfect Pokeball for you! Lurball! And. If you manage to catch a Pokemon using your fishing rod, then it's time to use that lure ball. It's the absolute best Pokeball for people who like Pokemon that live in the water. Pokeballs are just full of surprises, don't you think? Like this one on my head. It's full of cocaine. Yeah, you have fun with that. Now. Oh. Quarglump. You've got a scratch on your arm. That scratch could be the difference between life and death. We will not battle this way! Thanks for waiting, your Aracuda. His name is Brainless! Get it right or don't say it at all. And stop telling me about a rare Pokemon over at Wedgehurst. I don't care! I only care about having my team all at full health. Now then, let's get going. And take on this gym. A Nuzlocke ain't worth nothing if there ain't no tension in the battles. That's where the excitement comes in. Hey there, Jim. Yeah, throw me in over my head. I'm ready to learn how to swim by being thrown into a shark tank. That's the best way to learn. Yeah, I don't care. Shut up. Let me go. I'm going in. You have fun being there and just standing in front of the door. I have battle to do. Battle will be mine. Victory will belong to me. And we got water. Water! And pipes. Yeah, I get it. It's a door. Now shut up and let me go! The Hullberry Pokemon Gym's mission is this! A challenging maze, and you must reach the goal to clear the mission! However, some paths in the maze are blocked by water! What should you do then? Try pressing the red button over there and imagine... And I imagine you'll figure it out, future champ! Yeah, I will. Now shut up and let me go! I got a challenge to complete. And I'm not sure if I should be leading with Brainless, or if I should put somebody else up front. Let's lead with Nurbluck. Nurbluck hasn't had any action in a while. And this is where she gonna really shine. Oh, Mary's idea ready to bask in the beauty of water type moves? Maybe. Or maybe I'm here to kill you. You ever think about that? Timpole. I don't remember exactly which game that Pokemon was introduced in. I want to say black and white. I don't remember too clearly. But I don't... But I remember not caring much for it. Well, look at that. Dead in one hit. Perfect. Guess I didn't need to grind at all. But some level ups would be helpful. Yep. Timpo and I were the ones who got soaked. Yeah, because I hit you with grass. Grass kill the water. Learn your type matchups, you stupid. And look at that water. Change in the water. Water flow get changed all right. Boom. That's all there is to this place. Just press buttons and move. And I'm gonna need to get through you. Because I need to hit that button. Press the button sounds too hard, but you got a thing about the order too. Yes, I know. I understand how puzzles work, Heather. Crabby. Ain't no crab strong enough to take on this monkey. We got a monkey, and it's ready to kill. Now poke him. Give him the poke. Doink. Take that. Heh. <laughs> Harden. You can harden all you want. It won't save you from a second poke! 
Give him the poke. Doink. Yeah! Dead. Dead ass crab. Ain't no crab deader than that crab. Any more crabs you wanna get dead, lady? Corfish, that ain't a crab. Oh, it is. More like a lobster or a shrimp. Poke it! Poke it like the rest! Give it the poke. There you go, it's a good old fashioned poke. Bubble beam! Oh no! The thing that barely does anything to me. Prepare yourself for a second poking! There you go. That's all the pokes you need. You are dead. I am victorious. And ye suck! Good. That's right. Ye get poked, and you will remember nothing but the horrible pokening that happened to you. Boop. You gotta press all of them buttons, and that's how you open up the path to go. Buttons! Buttons make water happen. Now, what other buttons are in need of pressing? I need to find a- yep, there's a blue one right there. But I need to hit the red wood. Gotta hit the red wood. Yeah! And then I press this one. And now... Huh. <laughs> gotta find a yellow one now. Oh, there's a yellow one. I can use that yellow one. And you know what? I'm gonna switch things up. Let's put Quarglump up here. No. Brainless. Do you have any moves that are actually good? I do not remember. Your moves. Aqua Jet, Fury Attack, and Bite. And Agility. Them's the moves. Brainless, if you're going to be used as a meat shield here, you need to be able to be a meat shield, so you need that experience! You need that meat shield experience! You gotta learn how to take a hit with your head. And what better way to learn than by taking hits with your head? Let's go, you dumb bastard! BITE THAT THING! Whirlpool? Ha! You missed! Now you're getting chomped. Somebody chomping up in here and it ain't torque for once. Chomp. Another bite. More blood. Perhaps you'd be a more effective weapon than a shield. The whole reason I got you was to eat water type moves. That ain't a water move. So yes, you are not a very effective meat shield. But you do hit rather hard. I do value that. I do value a meat shield that can hit really hard. But let's put up Torque. Torque getting in there. Torque getting some experience. Torque hasn't eaten any souls in a while. He hungers for souls. He. Hope he doesn't flinch when he gets hit here. Okay, he's faster, that's good. Now Torque eats. You get the flinch! You get your soul eaten! Chomp! That's right. Be strong, Torque! There we go! Torque for the win, motherfucker! You ain't killing my Torque! Now that I think about it, I think there was a character on a cartoon named Torque. Yes, in Vader Zim, there was a character named Torque. And in one episode, Dib was trying to work with him, and then Torque ends up going missing, and once he realizes, he just yells, Torque Smacky! And that's probably what I'm going to do if I ever lose Torque. Torque Smacky. But Torque will be laying the smacky down. He does not receive the smacky, he give the smacky. Who wanna get smacky? Okay, this is probably not a good place to be. If I press that button, then I'll be sealed in here and have to press it again. This is probably going to be a pain in the ass. 
I just need to find a red button. And I need to hit the blue button again to be able to reach another red button. God damn it. Okay, yeah, I think I got this now. I hit this button, then I hit the blue button, and then I'll be able to go down... I'll be able to go off that stairs right there behind me, and then I'll be able to reach the door. Yeah! Puzzle solved, gym mission complete. Now, as for the Pokemon, I think I'll lead with Quarglump. You'll be nice and strong here. And I've got Brainless to eat any hits that I don't want you taken. If you go taking them big hits, then we might have trouble. Now let's go, Nessa! We gonna get that badge. Or we're going to die horribly. We will see. We will see. Come on, bitch! Show me what you got. Welcome, honored gym challenger. I think you already realize, but I'm Nessa. Sorry to have made you look for me. God damn, my shoulder itches. Why? Shoulder, stop itching. I don't doubt my humble mission's difficulty, yet you clear it. Your mind, as a Pokemon trainer, must be quite refined. Well, not really. I only focus on the kill. No matter what kind of plan your refined mind may be plotting, my partner and I will be sure to sink it. Yeah, you keep telling yourself that. And I'm gonna stomp your ass. And I'm gonna stomp it hard.